Good morning, students. I am Vinay sir. So welcome back again. This is our new chapter in class four, subject moral science. Okay, so today's chapter ten. The name is self esteem. Okay, self esteem, and its value is self respect. Okay, everyone has self uh, self respect. Yes, and everyone should be self respect. You know what is self respect? Self respect refers to the respect with a person of his her own or herself. Okay, it is a feeling of confidence and pride that one has in his uh, own abilities and worth. Okay, which so we can show our abilities and worth, what we can do, what we cannot do, our weakness or our uh, strong. Okay. It is a feeling which makes you believe that what you say and do is right and good. Okay, what you are saying is whether right others are liking or not. Okay, whether you are uh, speak right or wrong. Okay, it refers to the spirit of self-esteem, whereby you are satisfied and happy with your own self and your character. Okay, if you have self-respect, if you have self-esteem with it. Okay, so we are always happy. Okay, with our ourselves. We are always happy with self, ourselves and our with our character and whatever we are doing. Okay, but we are always happy. Okay? So you know the people of China they are very much self-respect. Okay, so here the one story of China. And so his name is Life of Fan. Jonghyun. Okay, life of Han Jonghyun. So, this is the story of one small boy. Okay, his name is Han Jonghyun. Okay, so when Han Jonghyun was very little boy, very small boy. Okay, that time his father passed away. Okay, his father died. Okay, so his mother remarried again to another man. Okay, so. His uh, man had already three sons. Okay, that already his man also had already three sons, and his wife was had expired. Okay, so this small boy Fan Jonghyun's mother be married to that man. Okay, so that all the three sons they were not loving, not liking to Fan. Okay, they were always hating. They were uh, not uh, having friendship with Fan. Okay, so. That time, early time, uh, fan was thinking uh, just okay, it's okay, okay. But slowly, slowly, that uh, all three sons they started irritated of fan. Okay, irritated means I have to down here, annoyed. Okay, just they are not wanting, they are not liking. Okay, so and just they started to see unpleasant word. Okay, unpleasant word. Okay, means uh, unpleasant means what? They are not discomfort word. Okay, you cannot uh, bear the, this kind of word. Okay, so one day what happened? And decided to leave the house. Okay, so everything he whatever he belongs to him he uh, collected and he left the house. Okay, he went to study. Okay, he went to study at Yingtian. Okay, this Yingtian is a place name. Okay. This is Chinese name. Ying Tian is Chinese name. Okay. Uh, sorry, Ying Tian Fu in Nanjing. Nanjing is a place name. Okay. Ying Tian is one uh, Guruji's name. Okay. So he went there. Okay, and started studying all seriously with great care. Okay, he started to study there. Okay. So, so he was because of this. Uh, Fan was very hardworking boy, very hardworking boy. Okay, he started with great care. He started study with great care. Okay, so even he was when feeling sleepy, sometimes uh, when doing study, he are feeling sleepy. You know, okay, he just splashed cold water on his uh, eyes, and again he was doing study. Okay, so like that he was continuously studying, studying, and he was living very simple life. Okay. His situation was very simple. Okay, he was just um, so seeing this situation, one of the best friends of fans he uh, wanted to help fan. Okay, one day what he do? That fans friend brought some delicious food for him. Okay, because 
He was eating uh, something, okay, very little. So that friend thought, I uh, will help. Then he was okay. So that friend brought some delicious food and gave it to him. So the friend also accepted this very nicely. Okay, but did you take it? That food he gave it to other needy men, okay, other needy people. Okay, so knowing this, that friend also felt very bad. So next day he asked, why you uh, not eat my food? Why you have given to others? So then fan told him, this friend, uh, so see friends, you can help me one day, two day. But later on, all the day you cannot help me. Okay, so I have to be prepared for myself. I have to uh, do something for myself. Okay, so like that he spent his study continuously and later on he get one nice job and now he can live a comfortable life now. Okay, so like that he struggled in his life. Okay, he struggled continuously in his life and at last he now he can live a comfortable life. Okay, so what's the moral of the story? Means everyone should have self-respect. See, everyone should have self-respect. Because this fan, Chongyal, also had self-respect. If we, he uh, would have lived there only, in his stepfather's house, then he cannot build up his self-respect. Right? He made his own self-respect by doing something else, by doing hard work. Uh, okay, by showing his hard work. Okay? So, what of the stories? Everyone should have self-respect. Everyone should have self-respect. Okay? So, something we learned from this chapter. Self-respect is a very good quality. Self-respect is a very good quality which you should develop within you. How we can develop? By doing something good always. Okay, we can do, we can be self-respect by doing something good always. Okay? And under, by respecting your own self, you become confident. If you are not confident, I can do this. I can do this work. I can build up our confidence by our self-respect. Okay? So children, I hope you may have understood this chapter. And uh, some hard words I have written down here. You can uh, uh, write down in your copy this. Okay? Uh, till then, thank you all. Bye. Okay.